Hey everyone, I'm going to make a quick video today showing you how to uh, create test orders on both development store and on a live store uh, in Shopify. And I'd made a previous video showing only how to do it on development stores. And I had a lot of people asking, how do you do this on a live store as well? And so that's what I'm going to show you today. Um, and it's more of a trick than anything because you can't actually create test orders on a live store, store but you can create discounts and use those to create a free order and pretty much void the order right afterwards. Um, or you can keep it through the keep it going through your fulfillment process if you want to test all the way through. So to do this, you're going to head over to discounts. Uh, once you're into the shop, Shopify admin, head to the left-hand side and click on discounts. Click on create discount. And we're going to create two different discounts. Um, specifically, if you are charged for shipping, you're going to need to. If you don't charge for shipping, you're not going to need a free shipping discount. So we're going to start with amount off order. And I'm going to set this to a percentage 100. And you can generate a random code if you want. Just so I remember it, I'm going to do free test. Um, and then if you, the only field that makes sense to set um, for some people would be limit number of times that the discount can be used in total. Um, that's just to limit your risk if for whatever reason you think this is going to get out, the code. Um, and you don't want to delete the code. But I'm just going to delete it when I'm done. So I'm not going to worry about that. And then I'm also going to click shipping discounts down here. Um, so this means that you can combine this discount with a shipping discount. Um, so if you want your entire order to be free, make sure to do that if you charge for shipping. I'm gonna save that. And then I am going to create a free shipping discount. And I'll call this free shipping. And I'm gonna allow it to combine with order discounts. And we can save this. Now, I actually don't know if my store charges for shipping, so I'm creating this just in case. Uh, but now, go to your online store. Uh, since mine is still a development store, it's going to be a preview. And let's go ahead and find this product. All right, I have found the product page for the product I want to test with. So I'm going to go ahead and add this to the cart. And I'm going to view the cart. And then I'm going to check out. Okay, I've entered a completely random address here, so this isn't my address, but I've entered this address. You can see it calculated the shipping cost, so I'm going to go ahead and apply the two discount codes, which one is free test. I'm going to apply that, and then I will apply free shipping. I'm going to apply that as well, and now it should no longer ask for payment, and then you can use the same as the shipping address, whatever. I'll press complete order and it should process my order. And there it is processed. So if I go back here and go to the orders, you can see it's going to show unfulfilled and it costs zero dollars. So if I click into here, um, you can create the, the shipping label. If you want, um, you can also cancel the order up here, which is what I would do. You can also just pr uh, mark it as fulfilled. All those are totally fine. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and press cancel order and just cancel the order, restock the inventory. And the order is canceled. This was effectively a test order. You can do whatever you need with this. Um, and you should not have to pay for anything here. So I hope this video helped. If it did, please leave a like, subscribe, and leave any comments with any questions you have below. Thanks for watching.